Hey guys, it's Ian here from CADSpace. In this video, I'm going to show you a little bit about uh, using decals in your product design. This is great for adding some extra visuals and getting things looking even more realistic. So we're going to start with a tablet I grabbed from 3D Content Central. If you're working with products like this in your designs, you could just leave it as a standard 3D dimensional model as is, uh, just to see how everything fits, but that can look a bit boring. So uh, what I've done first is just made a sketch for the screen size and the dimension that accordingly. Uh, if you go up to curves, there's a good little feature called split line. Hit that, make sure it's on projection. The sketch was already selected and then hit that face. OK, and then that now splits the surface for us. So we've got a screen to work off. So to add that decal, go into display manager. Make sure it's on view decals up the top here. Right click, add decal. Now we've got standard ones on the right, but because ours is custom, hit browse. Select our screen image. Now click on our new screen surface. And it places the, the screen picture on for us. We can move this around manually or resize it manually. But because we've got a reference for that surface, if you go to mapping, fit width and fit height to selection and that will resize it exactly to what we specified earlier. A uh, good thing about this feature as well is if you've got uh, a bottle for instance with a curved surface and you want to add a, a label to that via the decals, <clears throat> the decal will actually fit to the curved surface and makes it nice and easy for us. So if we hit OK on that, we now have a decal. Another good thing is it does carry through into renders as well. So if we do a quick render on this, the decal should show up in this as well. And here we go. We've got a nice looking tablet. Nice and easy. I hope this is helpful and all the best with the designs.